this sign probably about four or five years ago and it's just a cabinet door. A friend of mine bought a farmhouse and remodeled the kitchen and I was blessed with all the cabinet doors and I made um, a lot of really fun stuff with them. So anyway, I made this one a few years ago and I just want to update it. I decided to make this one of my Christmas decoration oh. updates. And in the Christmas theme we have this year of reusing and reducing and recycling, uh, my husband when I got married had this nativity set and it was kind of a cream color and unfinished. It was the kind that you paint. Um, you know in in detail and of course that is not my I don't have those abilities so I really like how um, white looks so I took the nativity set with my husband's permission because it was his and he did bring it into our marriage we've been married for almost 13 years and we've had this set anyhow so I painted it all white and I do need to kind of go through and maybe do a little sanding and but for now, that's that's that was an update, and we do have the full set with the the animals and and such. But I really like the way it turned out white. It was kind of a creamy off-white color, and same, oops, same with our Christmas angel. Um, she was kind of an off-white, creamy, and she's metal, and I painted her white, and I'm really happy with. The way, I don't know if I can get her all on here. I'm really happy with the way she turned out. So I have a before and after picture of her that I'll include. So I did wind up going back and adding a little gold to my angel, just to her, the outskirts of her wings and her crown. But I like the way that looks, and who knows what I'll wind so up those doing are next year. Three ways. Um, another sign that I made last year which I think I just need to kind of spruce up a bit, was also out of a cabinet door. And I painted it with chalk paint. And these are the same Walmart letters that you can see in my other videos. And then my idea was to write in chalk or a chalk pen. Um, it's a little smudged and needs to be wiped off. But that, along with our updated Believe sign, will go on our front porch. So we'll see what I can get done here, but I'll show you the nativity set as a whole and see, you can see how that turned out. So this is what I had put together for our front porch. 
and it just looked a little messy and so I have this metal angel here and these poinsettias and then these are just clippings from our tree and some pine cones but it just didn't seem I'm gonna add these signs and see how that it looks. It still looks a little messy to me um, but I think that's okay. We have our two signs and this old my friend that gave me those cabinet doors when they cleaned out the barn on their uh, property when they bought the house there were these old candle molds and that's what that is there. Maybe I'll put something on that little chalkboard sticker but I've used them for all kinds of cool stuff and I really like the way this looks. I like this kind of repurposed look. These chairs I got on Craigslist they're kind of parlor chairs and uh, they're working as a little table here so I think I'm going to leave it like this I might put some red bows on the top of the chairs there. I'm not sure. Anyhow, I like the way it turned out.